bad, <laughs> some very bad Valentine's days was uh, your boy. You ever see Hot Ones? Hot Ones. The one where the actors and the entertainers be eating chicken wings answering questions? I have. I have. Okay, well, the host of that, Sean Evans, was dating um, an adult film star, Melissa Stratton. I don't know if you've heard. I'm, I've never, seen, never heard of her. I've seen some of her work. She's very talented. Very talented. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's, she's very And you built. said he lost her? He decided to break up with her because the relationship got too much attention, which rightfully so. You're dating a... Prawn star. What do you it. like? Sometimes I be wondering what guys be thinking when I they. Really, that's what I was wondering when I'm they like, enter into certain relationships with women, and then all of a sudden get taken aback. Like I can't believe. Like hold on, my guy. What do you think you signed up for? Like I don't get that at all. I don't understand how you as a man could just date a, a person from that line of work. I mean, look, there's somebody for everybody. I'm not saying I wouldn't date a porn star. I'm not I saying I would. I'm, I mean, I'd smash a porn star. We'd I'm not go out to a steakhouse after, but <laughs> I'm not going to say I wouldn't. I'm not going to say I would. Everything for me is a case by case basis. You know, people I be in a relationship. Eh, everybody has a past. Everybody has a past. It but might still be going on. on and might, I mean, everybody she, she's has still a past. A working Look, porn star. Hold on. We haven't oh, seen this um, Hulu um, special yet from, what is it, Freak Neek? So, Freak yeah, Nick. we don't know whose past is on video yet. But I'm I, sure it's not as bad as being a full fledged adult film star. I'm probably, you're probably right. But I just, I don't know. I don't, I might, I might not. More probably swaying to might not, but. As I get older, I, I see things differently, and I, I just look he at took things her differently. To the Super Bowl. Mm. See, that's love. That is love. You don't take just any random woman. To no, because you know how much Super Bowl tickets are. He took her to the. Uh, he took an adult film star to the Super. That's love. Well, and then he, he fell out of love with her. He quickly. decided to end it. When the public knew about it, so there, there's at least some level of shame attached to this. Well, That's then he's a, a he's a goofy for real. Then if he if he got felt like he was shamed because the public knew about it, you knew too. So what you think was going to happen? Okay, so he said he wanted to keep his relationship per, uh, secret, private, but it took a turn after she shared photos from last weekend's game. So, which is another dummy move. How are you going to take a woman to the Super Bowl and not expect her to show pictures? Like what? I don't understand these guys sometimes. And then, on top of that, she's already famous, right? So, you were going to be in pictures anyway. Yeah. Because there were going to be people who recognized her and were going to take pictures. And I'm exactly. sure you were going to be in some of Like, somebody pictures. took a photo of her and you. Because somebody knew one of either of the couples. I know a lot of dudes knew who, who his girl was. So, I mean, like, sometimes, like... Dudes do really be playing like lame. Uh, they they That's be lame, lame as hell. Like they really do be lame. Sometimes chicks be right. Some of these dudes be lame. Like you took on this chick, knowing what she did. Now, yes, you might have wanted, like you said, to keep it private yes. and stuff like that. But then you got tickets to the Super Bowl, so that's out the window. Exactly, privacy is gone yeah, when you take it. You, take it a you to signed away the Privacy Act right then when you took her to the Super Bowl. <laughs> so that that was your mistake off top. Mm, mm, mm. You could have went to the um. You could have went to any sports bar. I took and watched it to a it. sports bar. So you're gonna be ashamed of it. That, People gonna find out one way or another. But you take her to the greatest sporting event, event of all time in North America. Pretty cool. much. That, that's what's up, my guy. Smart move. But I mean, like I said, at least he knows it's a shameful thing, which is why he's like, "Damn, I'm I'm dating a porn star." 